Okay guys, we are back. Today we are gonna be playing the finale of Firewatch. And I, I'm really so excited to find out how this ends. Especially because we left off on like such a cliffhanger. Basically we were on the radio with Delilah and someone intercepted our call and coughed. And then she told us to go back to our tower and stay there. So I don't know, things are really getting so intense. I, I don't even know where the story is going, but I'm really, really excited to find out. I don't know if we're gonna HU with Delilah or if Delilah's gonna K-board us. Oh, by the way, I said at the last stream that we only have one day left. We actually don't have one day left. We have like two or three, I think. Oh, oh my God, I'm scared. Oh, sunshine, sorry. Went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Um. Why, honestly, why is she so chipper? I feel like why, there was just so much drama. I didn't sleep a wink last night, and I've been going crazy for the past six hours of sunup. How are you so chipper? Well, it's a new day. What a day, this day we've been given. Maybe I am actually asleep right now. Maybe I didn't stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. Very suspicious, to be honest. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? Um, it's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Yeah, okay, I'm looking at it. Um. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great, just... Wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. Yes. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. it. It's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe oh. you should take a midday hike to. I get it. She's trying to talk to me, like, in code since someone's on her radio. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Okay. Cottonwood? So where even is that? Okay. Oh, there it is. Cottonwood Creek. Okay, that's actually not too far. I feel like a lot of times they're like sending us on the craziest f***ing hikes across the entire f***ing forest, but this is not that bad. We can do this. Let's go. I thought she was being sus, like I was so quick to call her sus, but she actually is kind of being big brained there. Oh man, this is so relaxing. Whew. I know there's someone stalking me right now, but I mean, damn, this is just beautiful. The sound of the running water, wind blowing through the tree leaves, the giant fire that's blazing in the distance. This is just, honestly, just so nice. Okay, we're almost there. Last time we had to go to scout camp, which was that direction. So we just need to go the opposite way. <gasps> oh, I recognize that. All right. It's the cottonwood tree. Oh, take a picture. That's honestly, that's a good idea. This is beautiful as well. Look at this beautiful shot I got here. Yes, like right here. Oh, wow. Oh my God, I can't wait to get that one developed. That is gorgeous. All right, we're here, I think. Ski. Now, aren't we here or do we have to keep going? Oh, we're going to the creek. We're going to the creek. All right, I'm just at the tree. This is the creek. All right. Girl, I'm here. Why can't I? I guess I'm not actually here yet. Is it this one? Am I not at the creek right now? I'm literally standing in the creek, Delilah. Hello, Delilah, I'm in the creek. 
Oh, go to the cash box? Okay, wait, where even is it? Oh, it's up this way, okay. There it is. Okay. There's a cash box here. Yes, there is, but I changed the code and left you something in it. <gasps> really? It's five, six, seven, eight. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I was in a rush. <laughs> okay. All right, let's copy down this map. Just one stray match. So f***ing true, you guys. <gasps> a new radio! And a book. Three blind rats. I swear these mean something. I don't know. See ya. I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy f***. Henry, we have to get into that site. So true. Whatever these people are doing, it's- What the f*** is going on? People are listening to us? I don't know. Our radios are tapped? Are you f serious? <clears throat> why is he so shocked? We knew that. That's why I left we knew that. I just got. How, how, how is this even possible? I don't know, Henry. What do you know? You know that I'm scared. I'm scared too, Delilah. Who is doing this? Who is doing this? I don't know who could be doing this. Henry, I've been at this job off and on for 13 years. Sometimes here, sometimes over near Jackson, a couple times down in Wind River. And nothing like this has ever happened before. What about other lookouts? I just changed clothes laying on the floor because I don't know who could be watching. <laughs> Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Me. Someone else in on this? Anyone? Uh, this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Are you sure? Yes. I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. <laughs> They think she's crazy. Lady troubles. Oh, so oh. No, this isn't happening. To Talk about else. gaslighting. Asking. Um, all right, I'm gonna find I'm answers. Back to the gate, and now that I've got an axe, we'll know something soon. You need to get into that site. Call me when you find something. Okay, Delilah. Sounds good. Um, I just have a little question though before we keep going. And don't you hack into radios via like? the frequency is like by tuning into a specific channel. So does it not matter that we have new radios? Or, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I get it. Maybe switching them would help, but I also feel like it didn't do anything. So they may know that we're on our way right now, but whatever, we're gonna go up here to this gate. Oh my God, which is so far away. Let's get going. We've got a journey. Jen and her mega mind era. Hey, uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. What? What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that... What? Why did she do that? I told her not to do that. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I told you to say the minimum and just keep it vague. I know, and I didn't. I, I I just didn't want to be hassled. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Damn, um... bottom of this what is this a clock god damn it delilah what the f was that uh, i just heard something delilah 
what is it? I'm running, I'm running. I don't know. It was goddamn terrifying. Yeah, I'm running, I'm running. Well, it could be an elk, or it could be someone trying to get you to radio about a loud noise so they know where you are. <gasps> Stop, Delilah. <sighs> How about you don't do that again? Oh my god, where am I going? Where am I going? I'm scared. <laughs> Oh, I think I know where we are. Yes, it's the lake. Okay. It's the lake where we first saw the girls. So now we need to go this way. <gasps> okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. <gasps> there it is. I'm scared. I'm scared. All right, where's that gate? Over here. <gasps> okay. Ooh, gate meet axe. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Oh my god. Copy that. <gasps> okay. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Go. <clears throat> oh my god. I smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Oh. Okay then. Okay, I mean, honestly, if it was me, I would at least close the door. But, whatever. Oh my god, we're inside. Oh my god. Ew, 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 would be. Oh my god. Oh wait, let me report my bee sting. I got stung by a bee. Okay. <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> yeah. Did it did it hurt? Yes, kind of. Uh, okay, I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, oh my god, I'm nervous to read this. If you are trying to reach Dr. Simmons, he is on site from August 15th to October 15th. University owned equipment is the responsibility of Dr. Johnson. Government owned equipment is under the purview of Cat Ferdinand. Remember, this is a controlled area and any issues, malfunctions, or violations should be reported immediately. Okay. Why can't I close this? I'm being so, I'm not doing a very good job right now. It's getting very dark as well, you guys. Uh, I should get moving. Which direction am I supposed to go? I can't see a goddamn thing. Oh. Oh, whoa. What is this? <gasps> it's a long way down. Holy sh**. Okay. What's that? Oh, it's just a tree. Oh my god. This is spooky. What is all this, this sparkly stuff on the ground? Oh my god, I'm taking pictures of evidence. Alright, I got it. <gasps> There's more sparkly stuff. What is this? Is this just like a game malfunction? Like a graphics malfunction or what? Because on my screen it looks really weird. Sight. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. D, there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20 foot tall transmission tower. I mean, they could probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. Like, what is this? I'm sorry, this has to be a graphics malfunction because these are just looking like dead pixels on my screen. It's supposed to be wet rocks, like, uh, it's giving dead pixels. 
Is there anything I can do? Can I turn this off? I, actually, I guess I shouldn't be f***ing around with anything. Let's just keep going. Oh my god. This is not looking like the normal great outdoors to me. This is looking like the industrialization era. I'm supposed to go in there? I'm scared! What if someone's in there? And what is this shit? Soil grid. Oh, they're doing something with the soil out here too. It's all gridded off. Hey, maybe you were right about the lichens. I'm scared. someone in there? I'm fully inside. I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. This place sleeps three. They've got a row of cots here. So they live and work in the same tent? Yeah, it's all one operation. <laughs> like us. Yeah, like us. I swear someone's in here. I see their little tootsies. Report map. Okay. Shit. Ooh, what's this? A map here that confirms they're tracking my, our, people's movements. The map's got all sorts of paths and areas mm. marked off on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? I'm not sure, but I think so. Oh my god. There's a mess as well. Let's report desk mess. The desk in here is a mess. I mean, it's, it's like someone was in a rush or knocked a bunch of stuff over on accident. Oh. Hey, this desk seems to be where all the monitoring is recorded. Just dials and computers and sorts of doodads. Holy sh**, you don't think they're able to record our heart rate and stuff, do you? Seriously, at this stage, <gasps> I believe just about anything. Oh, it's an earthquake monitor. All right, what's this? Oh, subject numbers are frequencies. Oh, whoa. Male, frequent departure from Two Forks area. That must be me. Female, this has to be Delilah. Avoidance behaviors. Consult previous data. Unreciprocated desire for copulation, conflict with other males, disproportionate, disproportionate food intake. Okay, this is so weird. In the last episode, I was like, I feel like they're not monitoring us, but I guess I was wrong. This is just so weird. Why would they be monitoring us like this? And who are the bottom two men? Okay, maybe it's those guys that we keep finding the notes of writing back and forth to each other because the one guy kept talking about sex, honestly. I felt like I felt he's always talking about trying to get some. Let me just take a picture of this for evidence. Can I tell Delilah about this? Like, Okay, so there's a log here that tracks the movement of four distinct subjects. You and me? Uh, yeah, definitely me. And I suppose you too. What about the other two? The Goodwins. The Goodwins? Are those the, the dad and the son? I can't even remember. I'm just gonna say I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe another couple that's out here? Do you have any ideas? It's just you and me, Henry. Yeah, I know. Hmm. We'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here. Okay, well, I'm still looking around, girl. Supplies. What else do they have here? I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. All right. What's this? Can I look any closer? What is this? What is this? What the fuck? 
conversation chart. No way. <laughs> Someone in the chat said, bro, imagine the Ryan you and it literally made me look to the door immediately. Um, oh my God. Okay. Still, there's nothing else I can like report on. Peanut butter. Peanut butter? Now, what is this for? Biff. Oh, shit. I need to put that back where it was. So they don't know I was here. Please, just put it back on the shelf. All right. That, <laughs> that's as good as I'm going to get. All right, what's over here? Hard case. All right, let's open this. <gasps> what is this? A wave receiver. Using your Anderson Wavefinder wave receiver. Look, it's any strong signal. Green light, target straight ahead. Distance of light equals strength of signal. Tone, source of signal. Oh my God, they can come into any conversation because they're just tapping into the frequencies. Just as I suspected. Okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. All right. Wait. Is that not this right here? It's just right here, no? Oh my god, I thought I was about to be... <laughs> I thought I was about to be jump scared. Hmm. <gasps> oh my god, is there... Clear away. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god, it's right here. What is this? Oh my god, what is this? It literally said my name on the... And Delilah's. Oh my god. Oh my god, they are monitoring us. Are you shitting me? What? What is it? There's a folder of reports here. Look at this. What do they say? They're assessments about the two of us. There's stuff in here about Julia. No way, they really like are. What? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is. What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus. Henry, do you hear me? It says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this. I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Stop! Delilah, we're firewatch! That's insane! Delilah. What? Think about it. I am, and I think it's insane. They'd be fucked. Yeah, and how about if that fire comes up the mountain, or someone were to die in it? We call it in? We call it in? Yeah, maybe. Oh, Delilah. Oh God, Delilah, no. No way. What about the nature, Delilah? Maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's definitely not the best idea. Ah, uh, so fucking wound up. Oh my god, I I really want to read these closer because they're honestly funny. It's okay, it's All okay. Right. I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. Look at these really quick. I know we might not have a lot of time, but it says that I'm guilt ridden. Susceptible to influence, unsure of self, and reliable. It says that Delilah is reliable, observant, charismatic, selfish, skewed perception of personal history. Susceptibility to manipulation, three, and I'm a nine? I'm shaking these. Give me the goddamn report. All right, let's go. We gotta get out of here and fast. Oh 
my god, the music, the music. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Oh, I thought I was about to go down there with those rocks, so. Hey, sh the bridge collapsed climbing out of here, and um, now it looks like there's smoke coming from the site. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. This it wasn't <gasps> me. What? <sighs> what do we do? How did that happen? Uh, let's call it in. Just call it in like any other fire. And what about who started it? What about them? It wasn't me, girl. The person who started it? Yeah. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Bro, when did this fire start? That was... That was huge. That was a huge fire when that start. And was there an explosion? I didn't hear anything. That was wild. Who is listening to us? Oh my god, I'm in my... I'm in my f***ing unhinged arc. Putting notes all over the goddamn wall. Uh-oh. This receiver just picked something up. Uh, what? What thingy? What now? I found a device that picks up frequencies. It's how I found the reports last night, and it's going off now. It just picked up a fre frequency? Yeah, what could it be? I don't know. You gotta find out. All right, I'm Me? on my way now. You know what oh I God. just picked up? Uh, no. A fifth of Major Bueno Tequila from the creek. Delilah. Are you drunk? No. I am getting drunk. Now? Why? Delilah. Not now. Don't do that. Don't do that. I know. I know. Everything has gone to total shit, but you gotta live a little. You gotta allow, Hank. <laughs> oh, no, you're right, B. I can't think of any good reason why you wouldn't want your decision-making inhibited right now. Stop, the thing my is coming closer, is, I, I swear. I stay up all night worried I'm gonna lose my job because of the side fire, or I could not worry and let the chips fall where they may. It's not like there's any proof we were down there. My thinking is I'm gonna follow this wave receiver. Ooh, I like it when you think. Ay, ay, ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these thoughts are. All right, let's follow these beeping noises. Okay, it's to the southwest. All right, let's go. I'm scared! Oh my God, we're close. Okay, I just clicked to clear the gap in the bush and it made my character walk backwards. Just saying. Wait, it's doing it again. Let me put this down. There we go. <laughs> What's that? What is that? What is that? What is that? It's right here, it's right here. Oh, what is that? Oh my god, what is that? I'm scared, smash. What the f was that? I feel like we should take this backpack back and not just examine it right here, but whatever. See, I, I found some sort of supply bag light camping gear, some clothes, and basics, but it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine, but there's there's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with the half a bottle of tequila in her belly. 
Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire hasn't spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not you? It is not me. Oh my god, go. I'm going. Oh, there's my tower. Woo! I don't see anyone up here. She was just there. What? Oh! <gasps> What's this? Left a cassette player taped to my damn door. Uh, I don't even know what to say to that. Well, let's see what's on it. site. It sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. I'm getting and inside. It sounds like we were the ones who burned it down and that it was your idea. No. We are screwed. <laughs> the no. Lila, you stupid bitch. B, just don't freak out, okay? Don't freak out. Oh my god, what the f*** is happening, Henry? Oh my god, Delilah! Delilah, this is why we shouldn't be drinking at a time like this. Oh my god. I'm just glad that I didn't agree with Delilah's plan. I will never agree to forest fires. Never. Splunking? We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. Us? Girl, it's probably gonna be you. Oh, that's literally an option. Us? I'm, honestly, I'm just not gonna answer that one. Because I, I don't want to make her feel really bad by being like us, but I don't think we are in this together, Delilah. Like, I... Never wanted to burn this place down. I love nature. I love the forest. Why would I ever want to burn it down? Okay? That was not my idea. I will never agree to that. Never. I love nature. So I'm just going to ignore that. Let's head on over to the caves and get some splunking in there. Why don't you go together so there's more than one of you? Because Delilah hasn't done anything this whole time. It's just me. We will never go together. <laughs> okay. The cave is this way, I believe. Oh my god, these leg-breaking drops. Like, there's no way I just drop them all the way up there without breaking both my legs. Sorry, there's just no way. This is so insane though. I can't believe someone has been listening to our conversations and literally studying us. And now that we found out about it, they're framing us for this. Hey, you, you didn't actually make that call, right? To, to the other lookout? No, of course not, just Delilah. Stuck in my craw. I, I let myself imagine how f***ed I would be if you'd been lying to me. But now that I asked, I kind of just wish I hadn't. Of course I didn't. No way. They're just, they're trying to pit us against each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's not gonna happen, though. Thanks, Henry. 
I feel bad for Delilah, I'm not gonna lie, because she was obviously just in a, a heat of the moment, really upset that our privacy has been invaded on. Like, to be honest, it really has been. And of course she didn't start the fire, but now she's on tape. Kind of seeming a little bit sus. Um, I believe her. I know this whole time we're like, oh, Delilah's so sus, she's so sus, but I don't know. I believe her and I feel bad. She's being framed right now. Maybe I'm wrong though, I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. I'm about to get inside this cave right now, so. Here we go. Okay. Did I take the key back? Okay, good. I was gonna say, I shouldn't just leave the key in the door. Sometimes Henry is so stupid. Oh my god, they f***ing shut the door on me! I knew it! Oh my god. Delilah, someone locked me in the cave. <laughs> I just was talking about this. Working? Delilah, send someone to the cave, please! No! I can't get any damn reception. There's no service in the, the cave and we're stuck in here? Okay, this is actually nightmare fuel. I have to say this is probably one of my worst nightmares. All right. Well, I guess we'll just go in here. Loose rocks. This is so bad. I hate like tight spaces and stuff. All right, let's squeeze in here. Oh my God. Holy shit. This place is ginormous. Oh my God. Freezing in here. Okay, if this was real life, I could climb up here easy. So at least I know we have an out. Oh, what's this? Is anybody down there? A shoe. I'm gonna get lost in here. I thought the forest was confusing. This is like much more confusing. I feel like I'm walking in a circle. Ooh. I don't like this sound, how'd you? Am I out? I'm out. Okay. <laughs> hey, hey, are you there? Yeah, what is it? What did you find? Nothing yet, because someone tried to trap me in there. You saw someone? No, someone slammed the gate behind me and then ran away. I found another way out, but if I hadn't, Jesus. So, you, so you didn't find anything? No. Th there's a spot where someone had sunk an anchor, but the hardware's gone now. <sighs> I don't have any climbing equipment. What? I don't remember seeing that. I just have my ropes. I'm gonna hike back to Two Forks and see if I can find anything that could double as an anchor to use in the spot. Well, that doesn't sound dangerous. When did we see that? I feel like we just saw the shoe. Where am I? Oh, whoa, I'm all the way over here. She seemed a little weird, like she was expecting me to see something in there. I'm not gonna lie. I, I was on Team Delilah, but I'm not, I'm really not sure. Like, I wanna believe her. 
I want to believe her just because they have so many notes on her. And they're calling her, like, selfish and stuff. Oh, what's this? Delilah, I just found an outcropping that someone was using as a little fort. I think it was Brian Goodwin. Really? Yeah, he built himself a real castle. Whoa. Bunch of rocks stacked up. He made a wall and a perimeter. Oh, God. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. You know, maybe he made it because he was afraid of them. Uh, whenever I think of Brian possibly going through this crap, I get... I get sick to my stomach. Yeah. Uh, sorry. But he was in the middle of really sprucing up the joint when they left. Books. He'd hide out here to read comics. The black band, his grief is his enemy's sorrow. Everyone this guy loves gets killed, so he honors them with a black armband which gives him superpowers. Well, that's fing dark. It's a little weird that he just leaves so much of his stuff out here. Well, maybe they were in a hurry when they left. Mm. Like I said, he wasn't supposed to be out here. Yeah. I... Uh, they almost got busted. Brian liked to go out on the railing of the tower and wave at the planes that dump water on fires, and... Uh, I got a call because someone thought a kid was up in two forks. I lied. And just said it was Ned. If I ratted him out, they would have been forced to leave, and... I don't know, I guess I just felt like I was saving him from whatever shitty life Ned was gonna bring him back to. Not that it ended up mattering. What's this? What is this? What is this? There's a ham radio schematic Whoa. here, something Brian was working on. Yeah, uh, I think that was the one thing Ned did do with him, you know, tinkering on stuff like that. Cool. Postcard. There's a postcard. I read it in my head. Nothing important. <laughs> What's it say? Dear Ranger, my name is Brian Goodwin. If you found this note, it should be with a bunch of climbing anchors, I hope. Could you do me a favor and return them to me, Brian Goodwin, in the mail? My address is blah, blah, blah. If you tell me your name and address, I will give you a reward for this. You're probably wondering why I left these here. Well, they are my dad's and I don't want him to lose them, but I don't want to do any more climbing on this trip, so I thought I should pretend to lose them. But if you help me get them back, everyone will be happy. Thank you for your time. <laughs> huh. Brian stole his dad's climbing gear. His anchors. That's convenient. Yeah, it is. I think he was going to hide them in a cash box or something and never got around to it. I mean, he left a note for a ranger to find them and, and send them back to him in Nebraska. Because he hated climbing? Yeah. I mean, it sounds like Ned was pushing him and... Pretending to lose his anchors was the easiest way to put a stop to it. I hope it worked. God, what an asshole. Yeah. Man, that is the sort of thing that would have caused me to catch oh. a beating growing up. Yeah, well, I wouldn't put it past old Ned. Oh, my God. Remember we found that backpack a long time ago? Come up with a plan to get it. So it was his backpack. Science homework. What's this? School folder. I found an old school folder. Brian was a hell of a doodler. Explore deeper into the cave. Okay. Do I go this way or? What's this? Oh, we're going down like this? Never mind. Sorry, I thought this was the cave. <laughs> what do you think is in there? 
I don't know. What do you think? I don't know, really. I mean, we gotta find out. What do you think? Whatever it is, they don't want you telling anyone about. I mean, they closed the door when they could have just... Bashed your head in with a rock or chopped you up with a... Are you serious with this shit right now? Uh, a hatchet. God, are you sure you want to go back in there? I mean, what's my other option? Yeah. Yeah, especially now that I'm thinking about all the fun ways to be killed. I'm sorry. Look, at least whoever locked you in doesn't know you've gotten out. Hopefully you find whatever they're hiding in there, and it'll be worth the risk. All right, you guys. I'm quite nervous. Don't walk back around. Go back into the cave. Oh, uh, also, those girls turned up. Oh! Looks like you didn't kill them. Nobody did. They took some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and, uh... Landed in jail. <laughs> what the hell? I wonder if they know anything. I wonder if they know anything. If there's some way to ask them about whatever happened at their camp. I think we'd be smart to let sleeping dogs lie. You're probably right. Whatever. In the cave. Do you think the door is going to shut on me again? I'm watching this. Imagine I back all the way up into the giant gaping hole over here. Okay. Go. Someone's gonna cut my rope, I just know it. I'm scared. I'm scared. Uh oh. What is that? What is that? So it just marks on the rock? Why does it leave blood to me? How the hell were you getting back up? Oh, we can climb the rocks, okay. <laughs> Uh-oh. The music. <gasps> oh no! What is that? What is that? Is that... Oh my god. Where's the trigger warning? What the hell? Is that what I think it is? What is that? Ew, what is that? Really? No way. Oh uh, no way. <gasps> no way. I'm not going any closer. I have to go closer? Oh my god. This is a giant cave. No way. Seriously, I have to walk up to this right now? Oh my god. I'm sorry, you guys. Big TW. Oh my god. It's the only option. We have to walk over here. Oh no. Ew, no. Walk sideways. No. Where do I go? What do I do? Oh no. Oh my god. I can't look. I can't look. What do I do? Oh no. Where do I go? 
I'm freaking out. Oh my god. The hell? There's no way. Oh my god. All right. I'm sorry, you guys. You fell. Your stuff gave out. Oh, you poor f kid. Oh my god. Now what? What do I do? You're Brian Goodwin. Oh no. Step over. Okay. This is tr okay. Why do we have to get like a close up? This is traumatizing. Oh my god. Damn. I mean, when I saw the shoe, I was like thinking maybe someone fell down there. But what the hell? I was just not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Like, am, is, is Henry good? That's like a little traumatizing to see, you know? Climb out of cave and report body. Yeah, we gotta get out of here now. Oh my god. The character can't even run. I think he's traumatized from seeing that. Oh my god. Okay, now I can run. Oh my god. Get me out of here. Oh. I don't know how we ended up up here, but there's the exit. Okay, I have to get out of here. Oh my god. Oh my god, Delilah. Hey, D. There you are. I've been worrying my ass off. I feel like we should call search and rescue. You need to call search and rescue. Um, what? There's a body in the cave. It's Brian Goodwin. <gasps> Gotta be f***ing kidding me. How does that... <clears throat> what? I don't... <sighs> How? Climbing, I think, or... Made to look like a climbing accident. Mm -hmm. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't know. I literally he don't know what to say. Left him out here. I don't know what to say. He left his son. I'm sorry, Delilah. I'm so sorry. He'd be alive if I had told someone he was out here. I don't know where he'd be, but I can assure you it would not be rotting at the bottom of that cave. I... There's... there's... there's nothing to say. The hike back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. Not the only other body in this game being literally deceased. It makes it so much more intense. That's so true. We haven't seen anyone else except a dead body. Yeah, guys, I don't know about that because he said he didn't like climbing and it looked like a climbing accident, so I don't really know. Uh, no, I was just busy packing up. Well, there's going to be a lot more. The service says this thing is 2% contained. Well, is this the June fire or the site fire or... The two fires merged into one unmitigated disaster. Oh my god. I'm naming it after my lookout. You about packed up? Should oh. we talk for a sec? You know, about things? About what? Oh my god. This is awful. About how all this stuff is connected. The surveillance, the Goodwins, Brian's death. Look, I don't know what to say, okay? It's like, it's like the universe cooked up the cruelest thing to have happen. Does it connect to everything else? I don't know. I don't know if I even want to. Of course you do. There, there's gotta be a reason. Does there? Maybe. Maybe not. I wouldn't even know where to begin. Oh my god, my f***ing tracker's beeping. Well, f***. Uh, for starters, I guess you could find the source of that signal. Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. We don't know what it is. It could be nothing. Yeah, it could also be whoever was listening to us. Who, whoever made the tape. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, um, look, you should pack up everything you need in case we get the call and you can't come back. Okay. All right, look, if, if something happens... I'll remember you. I'm putting my wedding ring back on. I was hoping you'd have a backup plan or something. Yeah, um, okay, I'm probably gonna move to Canada. Ontario, maybe. No, I meant if something happens to me. Right, if you don't find out who made the tape and I have to hit the road. Oh, forget it. Be safe, Henry. What else do I need to pack? What's this? Cassette tape? 
I'll take that, I guess. Alright, I guess that's it. Alright, you guys. Let's follow this tracker. Oh my god, I can't get over this fire. Like, holy shit. How is this wood building even still standing? There's like embers floating around everywhere. Like, I'm really surprised it hasn't caught on fire. Uh, what about these things? Those tanks up there. The flammable tanks. This is crazy. This is crazy. All right, we gotta find the direction. Oh, west. I'm nervous. What was that? What's your status? I think I'm getting close. All right, well, I just got word that they are coming to get us. My place. You sound worried. No, it's... it's just... Brian? I'll coordinate with the evac team and let you know when to head towards the tram. It's north. Far. Past where you found that cut back in May. There's an emergency tram out there that will let you hike to the rendezvous point at my lookout. Okay. This way, we're getting closer. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm getting so nervous. Someone left a rope for me to climb up. I'm down near the lake. How do you know it's for you? <laughs> there's a tracking collar tied to it. Someone was leading me here. And there's another tape. Oh my god, Henry. The f***? Can we listen to this? Yeah, hi, Henry. <gasps> hey, you better find this before it burns up. We've been causing each other a lot of headaches. <laughs> Now I gotta go stake out a site that's as fit for living as the one you're about to find. You'll get it when you see it. You can't blame me for keeping an eye on you. Not after bumping into you back in May. Down by the cave for crap's sake. <gasps> I've been up here for three years. I kept it cozy. Winters are harsh as hell and I ran out of books. But I got that antenna rigged up and Delilah, she's a, she's a record you don't gotta flip. I kinda get why Brian took to her. About a week ago, I stopped worrying about you finding anything out, and that's right when everything went to house with you two. <laughs> you guys don't know anything about having kids, all right? Nobody knows nothing. It ain't Andy and Opie walking down the lake to fish every afternoon. It ain't Mayberry. But you gotta know, I didn't kill him. All right, we were climbing. I was teaching him. Brian was uneducated in the way to do anything. He just... He just fucking didn't sink his anchor the right way. You know, I thought about going back, having to answer questions, and having to get him put in the ground, and... I didn't see the point. Don't come looking for me. Sorry about your wife. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Well, I don't know why he put that on tape, because now I have a tape. Um... We found the surveillance operation. Okay, what does that mean? What is it? It was Ned Goodwin. He was the one listening to us. Just... him. Ned Goodwin? He made the tape? Yeah. He's gone. Deeper into the Shoshone. He doesn't want anyone to know he's out here. The... Because he killed Brian. Because he killed his f***ing son. Y you 
need to get back here. They say the helicopters are making rounds. Okay. I'm confused though, because what about that whole lookout? I'm going up this rope first. The game is glitching the hell out. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I can't believe it. We literally did bump, we bumped into him. That was the, the dark shadow that we saw in the first episode. What's up here? I'm scared, is he gonna kill me when I get to the top? Improvised hatch. he's got up here oh my god teen magazines oh my god well, am I gonna tell Delilah Research site info, how to break in. Staff return August 10th. Return borrowed equipment. Leave no trace. Oh, he stole the equipment from the, the research station. He wrote down everything he did to us. And everything he did every day. He was scared shitless. I bet. Oh my god. So weird. What a f freak. Goodwin was the one who wrote the reports I found at the site. What? Oh my god, he literally wrote guilty. Okay, he had to have killed his son. F guilty? Like, what kind of notes are those? Me when I'm guilty. Just writing it down. Father's Day card. He... God. What? Nothing, just some of Ryan's stuff. A role-playing rule book? Ryan was a nice-looking kid. Oh my god, sleeping bag from the teens campsite. Okay, he the whole time he was doing all of this shit. This is so crazy. He has to be guilty. I know he didn't like technically confess that he killed his son on that tape, but all signs are leading to he killed his son. Cause I mean he literally wrote guilty on a piece of paper and his son wrote down on his own note that he doesn't like to climb and that he's dying from a climbing accident. Very suspicious. So he spent his whole time monitoring us to make sure we wouldn't figure it out. And fucking with us. This is so weird. What a freak. Oh my god. What a freak. Winter needs. Well good luck with that. Oh my god. What a freak. You should see some of the stuff he was working on. I guess he had a lot of time on his hands. This boombox looks familiar. <gasps> I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. <laughs> it's the one I threw in the lake. Want me to say. We're in the middle of a fire that is at 22,000 acres and growing. Delilah! It's going to burn all of this up. Well, take a picture if you're so keen to remember it. Okay, maybe I will. You're not? I will be taking some pictures. I'll take pictures of these notes. Oh my god. He was rigging up stolen batteries to keep his stuff going. Hello, Delilah. Why doesn't she care? This is crazy. 
This is crazy. Oh my god, what's all this? Oh, it's the beer. Radio log. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at these notes on me. What the hell? He's lying on my name. Crazy like wife? Not a good guy. What the hell? Here, let me turn this way so you can get good light on it. Crazy like wife. I love how there's like a crazy 22,000 acre fire burning around me. I'm just hanging out in here. <laughs> I'm like, what? He's lying about me. They heard me. Fully believe there is a program. Use this. Oh my God. 2F almost caught me at sight. Oh, I think I'm reading them out of, am I reading them out of order? Yeah, I'm reading them out of order. Oh my God, here's when I show up. New lookout in 2F, Henry 2F. Saw 2F coming out of cave. <gasps> D calling for hikers list, delay her, she'll forget. Oh my God. He's literally been f***ing with us this whole time. Severed radio communications. D never called for hiker list. Can hear D and 2F concurrently. 2F hiked by cave. He seems less interested. Jules. Julie. Julian. Julia. 2F is a good guy. Oh my god. Maybe he wasn't lying on my name. D drunk again. <laughs> Alright. Let's get this one. Get a room. Hide supplies. D and 2F suspect conspiracy. Funny, if not dire. Observe and be ready to leave. Oh my god. Ideas. Oh my god. Vandalize D's tower. Pin on 2F. Try to make remote recording device. Research site move pit against each other. Oh my god. This guy is crazy. Stakes too high. No one will believe B was happy. Oh my god, make D and 2F less believable. 2F crazy like wife. Look, he went from saying that I'm I'm a good guy to saying I'm crazy. They hurt me. Oh my, I gotta keep all of these. I don't know why I'm throwing them all on the ground. Let me put all these in my pocket right now. Oh my god, this is crazy. Oh. He had quite the view. She's not answering me anymore. I bet Delilah's up in that helicopter on her way out of here without me, to be quite honest. He's got a radio base station up here. He was listening to us on that. Delilah, hello. I can't believe she doesn't care about this at all. Because this is wild. All right, I guess I looked at everything. And I guess I should get out of here. <laughs> to the evacuation point. Damn, I've got a long way to go. I'm not gonna lie. How is Ned getting out of here? Oh my God, pile of trash. The clothes line too. He's got a whole setup up here. I can't believe we never found this. Yeah, how is Ned getting out of here? Cause we've got helicopters coming for us, but Ned's like a missing person. <laughs> Ned Bundy, but for real. Literally. Ned Bundy, real. All right, let's get the hell out of here. I got a real bad feeling about Delilah ignoring my last couple of walkie-talkie calls. I feel like she left me here. So is Ned bad? I mean, yeah, I think so. I'm suspecting that he killed his son. Even if he didn't kill his son and it truly was an accident, I still think it's so, like, it's so f***ed up that he didn't leave and report it. So regardless of what the true situation that happened, I don't know, it's so weird. It's so weird. I think, like, him not reporting it makes him seem guilty. Even if he didn't kill him, it makes him seem guilty. So, I don't really know what... I just don't see why you would 
witness an accident and then not report it. You know, that's why I'm inclined to think that he killed him. No evidence of us starting that fire. Relieved that we're not crazy. There you are, Delilah. There wasn't some conspiracy. But I'm not. It was a sweet kid with a shitty father who hid out here like a coward after dumping him in a hole. Yeah. He wasn't a good dad. He wasn't a good dad. T. No fucking shit. But. But what? I'm sorry. God, it would have been so easy to tell the truth and have him sent home. I can't yeah. stop thinking about it. You didn't do anything wrong. Yes, I did. And now I've got to decide whether I tell people that he's down there so they can retrieve the body or not. And if I do, I'm going to be asked about Ned Goodwin. <sighs> D? Oh, f Is that a helicopter? Yeah, hold on. Wait for me! Hey! No, there's one more. Yes, here, yeah. Yeah, he's coming. Okay, uh, one second. Wait for me! Hey, they're here, but they're making rounds. They'll come back. Um, I think I'm gonna go with them. What the hell? Wait! Wait, just wait, okay? I'm not that far. Henry, they're here. They're waiting right now. Delilah, you're gonna be responsible Please. for two murders if you leave without me. I don't I don't wanna meet you and just sit here in a dead boy's shadow. Oh my god. Okay, I, I don't wanna do that. I know that sounds harsh. <sighs> okay, I'll wait. I'm not far. Okay. Oh, I'm going the wrong direction! Oh I went all the way the wrong direction! <laughs> I'm all the way down here. I have to go all the way up. Oh! They're definitely leaving without me. <laughs> I can't see anything, you guys. It's smoky as hell out here. I was too distracted by our conversation to check the map. Oh, my God. They're definitely leaving without me now. I lied. I'm like, I'm almost there. Oh, my God. I want my compass back, not this thing. Okay, I just need to go up past my lookout. That's me when I text, I'm on my way, and I'm like still sitting down on my bed. This is really how the game ends. I die in a forest fire. I will be there in no time at all. I'm almost there, in fact. I'm going the wrong way again! How do I get over there? Guys, they left me here for sure. All right, this way. Please tell me I'm going the right way. Okay. Whew. Oh my god, okay. This way? Yeah, okay, okay. What do I do up here? Is this really the way out of here? Oh my god, how do I end up back over here again? Oh my god. Okay, I gotta go this way. <laughs> I'm dead, I'm dead. No, oh, I'm actually dead, because I think they left without me. Okay, okay, okay. I'm back on track, I'm back on track. Are we not going over the fact that Delilah lied about her boyfriend, Ong? <laughs> I forgot about that. She's sus, but maybe that's why she doesn't want to meet. If her and the helicopter are gone, that's why. Yeah, okay, this way, this way. Home stretch for real this time. <gasps> Ooh. We have to take this over? Oh. Hell no. Hey, I'm at the evac spot near the ravine. Delilah, are you there? Delilah? Oh my god. Oh my god, she left me. She left me. I mean, in her defense, I did 
<laughs> I think I walked the entire like forest. Guys, I actually have to get in this. I think we're dying. I'm not gonna lie. I think, I think we're dying right here. This does not seem safe to do, especially during a forest fire. Delilah's tower! I said it from the jump. Delilah is an insufferable bee. Guys. It's Delilah's tower. Oh my god, we're really here. Are we gonna see her IRL? Did she already leave? I feel like she god, left. It's a nightmare out there. Hello? Delilah? Delilah! Oh my god, of course she left. Well, let me look in here and snoop around. Uh, damn it. Hmm. Is this me? Oh! I look much better than this. What is that? And is that my watchtower oven flames? I'll take that. Hello? Is anybody there? Hi. Y yeah, it's me. You're not here. No. Don't be mad. I'm disappointed. I'm not mad. I'm just You're not mad, you're just I just need to know how you were trusted by the state of Pennsylvania with a driver's license. Pot. I love you, I but just, your sense of direction is awful. You could have just said that. He really wanted me to stay. I did. And now I'm disappointed. Yeah. I know. Hey, it shouldn't take long for the helicopter to reach you. Okay. There's a debrief in a situation like this. Lots of questions. Ah, shit. So, taking stock, we found out an old lookout killed his only son and decided to become a lonely hermit. Yes. And we prevented one fire? Basically started another. Okay, so that's a wash. Oh, I'll have to figure out what I'm doing every summer from now on that isn't this. You're not coming back? No, and you'll have to. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I mean, Damn. How sad. I don't know what's next. Tell you what. Why don't you choose for me, and I'll choose for you. <laughs> All right. Sure. Um. Maybe. <gasps> Let's invite her to Boulder. <laughs> Maybe you could come back to Boulder with me and figure it out down there. Um, <clears throat> just, just a thought. You don't want me down there. Well, I just asked you. Uh, Look, I've got some things to do in Casper, and maybe I'll head south. I feel like it was out of character for my character to ask sure. her. Okay. So, what about me? I think you should go to Julia, and then you can figure it out. Ooh. Maybe put that typewriter to good use. Give me a sexy accent or something if you write about this. Oh I, my uh, god. Yeah. You gotta go see her. Would you? Henry, I... Look, you came out to put your memories back. What's going on in the background? Can you guys hear that? The siren? You're right. I mean, I think you're right. Good. When I get back, maybe I could, um... We shouldn't focus on this summer. And 
next year will roll around, and then the year after that, and then it's just a... Uh, I don't know. My Aunt Judy called it a pause in the hallway of time. <laughs> Did your Aunt Judy smoke a lot of pot? Yeah. Well, you should try to take her advice, too. Yeah, we'll see. There's the helicopter. They'll land back where you hiked up. Good luck, Henry. Right, you too. Good luck. No. Henry, you keep it for yourself, okay? Bye, Hank. Oh. Also, I have to address that dono earlier. That is so rude. I actually have very great directional skills. Um, I'm not even kidding. I'm really great at directions. I have COVID, you guys. I'm not feeling well at all. But I'm trying my best. <laughs> okay, anyway. Alright. Well. The helicopter is landing. Where is it? I don't even see it. Oh, it's already landed. the game wow honestly I don't know how to feel I really really love this game so much it's one of my more favorite games that I've played in a long time I think um the whole like murder mystery thing that happened at the end was so such a mind like I was not expecting that at all but I'm a little disappointed that we didn't get to see Delilah at the end. Honestly, she, she rejected us at the end. I don't know if I was choosing the wrong options or what. I really didn't know what to say to her at the end. I was just kind of trying to say anything to keep the conversation going because, hello, like, I, I don't know. I just feel like everything, like, just happened at the end and then we had to leave. So I was trying to keep the conversation going, but obviously she did not want to keep that conversation going with me. I get it though, because I feel like it was a little odd for me to ask her to come meet up with us in Boulder. It's just out of character, but I guess I just didn't know what to say. I just wanted to talk about the situation more, and she just rejected us. But I loved this game a lot. I think it was really well made. The graphics are so nice, and I really enjoyed it, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. I can't believe it's over. And I'm ready to play my next game. So if you guys have any suggestions, then make sure to leave it down in the comments below. Thank you guys uh, to everyone who suggested playing Firewatch. This game was so up my alley of something that I would enjoy. And I really did enjoy it. Even though we didn't get to see Delilah at the end, um, I still really enjoyed it. And I hope you guys did as well. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye, YouTube.